Hi, it's Gath Reed. Today, a shorter video than usual to follow up. On those videos you really enjoyed about how to simply build furniture. Using FreeCAD. I wanted to show you an additional tip for assembly, and I received an interesting comment from someone who pointed out the issue of nesting, which is the arrangement. of different prepared pieces for cutting. Indeed, manually placing each piece, one after the other on your panel can be tedious and a bit painful. They asked if there was a ready-made tool for this. I don't know of any. But I created a small macro to easily transform this furniture into a layout of pieces. I'll show you quickly. As usual, the macro is downloadable via the link in the description on the same platform where I share all support documents. If you're interested, let's go. First tip of this video, another alignment or assembly technique. In the edit menu, there's a tool called alignment, which is grayed out and unusable. I'll show you what it's for. This tool works when you're in a part with bodies. But in an assembly, it sometimes doesn't work. If we take the frame of the furniture and add a new part, like a small cube, we can use the alignment tool to position it precisely in the corner. without manually adjusting it with the transform tool. Select the fixed part first, then the part to move, and the alignment tool becomes usable. You can align vertices, edges or faces and the part will snap into place. This tool is simple and can save you a lot of time, especially for basic shape. Like rectangular boards and furniture assembly. Now let's move to the main topic of this video, nesting or material positioning. To prepare for cutting. Manually placing each piece is tedious. So I created a macro to automate this process. The macro aligns all the pieces automatically grouping them by thickness. It's not perfect, but it saves a lot of time. You can then adjust the layout as needed. The macro considers the volume of each piece, groups identical ones. And optimizes their placement on the XY plane.
It's very practical for preparing woodcuts. You can download the macro from the link in the description. It has two parameters, the panel width and the saw blade width. which sets the spacing between panels. The macro extracts each piece, groups them by volume, and arranges them optimally. It's a great tool for preparing cuts and saving time. I hope you find this useful. Let me know if you have any feedback. You can adjust the parameters, like the saw blade width, to see how it affects the layout. This macro can be very useful for small projects or preparing cuts for CNC machines. To use the macro, open it in FreeCAD, set the parameters, and run it on your assembly. If it doesn't work, check the Python console or report view for error messages. I hope this video was helpful. If you found it useful, leave a comment. Your feedback helps me create more valuable content. The goal is to develop practical workflows using free and open source software. Thank you for watching and I hope you enjoyed this video.